job was working for Angelo Emanuel at Angelo's Shoes in downtown Hickory. My first job was when I was 13 years old. I grew up in Claremont and on Saturdays they need somebody to gather eggs. My first job was being a counselor at Camp Sequoia on the Holston Lake, Lake Holston, and it was in Virginia, it was incredible. Uh, my first job was at Carolina Bagel Bakery in Hickory, North Carolina. Um, I made sandwiches, made bagels, made pastries, all sorts of bakery related things. My first job was working construction for a man named Dean Bumgarner. Uh, that was when I was in high school. I liked it a lot. It was a lot of fun. I worked with a lot of young people. Um, it, was, it was hard work. It was physical work, but it was enjoyable. There were seven hen houses, and uh, since the other guys were off work, there was five of us who were 13 or 14 years old and went in and gathered eggs. And the hardest thing that I didn't like was the roosters because they'd always jump on your backs. Like, my pay was minimum wage when I started, which at that time, minimum wage was $5.15 an hour. I got a 15 cent raise after like a year. <laughs> um, but um, because of my experience working there and fitting people with shoes, especially children, so carefully, um, two years after I'd worked there, I got a job at Sears department store at the mall and I made twice what I was making because I was making commissions. So it paid off in the long run, the experience, but the pay was not good. <laughs> The first project we did, we built a, uh, a duplex, uh, apartments, and uh, it, it was a lot of hard work, but it's, it's very satisfying whenever you see a project come together and you know you start from the bottom, you work to the top and you're finished, and you see continuous progress. That's, that's what I like about construction. I got to teach skiing, swimming, canoeing, sailing, and I was also a camp counselor, so I had, that first job I had for five weeks, eight children, eight girls, eight little girls who were, had just gotten out of second grade going into third grade. I remember one time that uh, we found a lot of rats in, in one of the hen houses and uh, we decided that uh, we'd take pitchforks and run them out under the manure and chase them down and kill them. So I remember we killed 67 rats one day. It was a tradition in my family, but I had no idea that my grandmother had been a part of of that camp. I learned a lot, uh, learned that, that hard work pays off and that uh, just learned a good work ethic, which I learned from my dad anyway. He always taught me to work hard and, and earn what you what you get and uh, and that just just reinforced that and uh, it, it was a it was just a good experience. Yeah.